as we begin this unit, uh, unit two of uh, finances, business finances, the first thing that we need to do is we need to start looking at how we define certain words. And one of those things is costs. When you start a business or when you're running a business, you need, need to be able to explain to um, those people who might lend you the money or other people what those costs could be. To begin with, uh, and in this lesson, we are just talking about two types of cost. We are talking about what we call startup costs and we are talking about operating costs. So startup costs, I have a definition written there for you. Begin Before a business can begin trading, it usually needs to spend money. These expenses are called startup costs. And I would explain that as being anything you must buy before you can start trading. One off big purchases. On the other hand, operating or running costs. Um, the word running might be the, the thing that gives you the clue there. Running costs means the expenses or the costs that you have while you are running your business day to day. So I have a definition there. Operating or running costs are the expenses a business has in its day to day operations. So we think of that as the things that need to be bought just or that, that have a cost just as you carry on trading. So examples I have here of a startup cost, um, a van, because uh, if somebody needs to be traveling and needs to buy a van, they need that. It's not linked to any individual um, job, but it is needed before you can actually start your trading if you need to be getting to places or delivering things. Another really good startup cost is a website. So before you start your job, your um, business, you would want a, a website up and running. So those are jobs that are needed at the start of the business. On the other hand, operating or running costs, we think of those as the, the smaller bits and pieces that are needed every day. Those might be materials such as paint for a painting job that somebody might have. It could be wages for the staff that you employ running the factory or even the electricity and power um, costs as the business runs day to day. So perhaps a bakery, the startup costs could be the ovens and a building, uh, but the operating costs would be flour and electricity and the wages for the staff who are there. Note that sometimes, in, especially in questions where you are given some options and you have to decide if it's a startup or an operating cost, you should, um, if you have an, op an option, think about uh, if you, you have to ex suggest a startup cost or an operating cost, suggest something that could only be one or the other. So suggest for a startup cost something that is a one off purchase you would need at the beginning, like a website or a van. And if you have to talk about operating costs, then think of materials or electricity, something that is used up every day. And then another um, thing to think of is that when you do um, answer a question, if you are asked to suggest costs, either startup or operating, you will be usually given a short scenario. So it could be a builder or a baker or a mechanic. And you must make sure that you include costs that would be relevant to that company or that type of business. And that's it. So I have a couple of, I've got an online task for you and I have a paper task for you. So I look forward to um, getting those in and we'll talk those through next lesson.